everybody. Today in our Bible story, Jesus was teaching his helpers a lesson about giving money to the church. Okay, so listen to why Jesus was not pleased with people who gave a lot of money, but was pleased when one woman gave only two coins. And you can follow along in your Bibles if you want to. It's Mark 12, 41 through 44. Okay? So one day Jesus was outside the temple teaching. And he was sitting near a place called the temple treasury. And this was where people put their money um, that they were bringing to give to the church. Their offering, okay? And there were containers <laughs> in which the people could deposit their offerings. So as Jesus was sitting and watching, many people came by to give their offerings. Some of the people were very rich, and they wore expensive clothes and lots of jewelry. And they would, they would drop handfuls of money into the offering bowl, okay? And you have to remember, back then in Bible times, they didn't have paper dollars, so it would be quiet. They only had silver, okay? And so these rich people would come, and they would drop handfuls of coins and it would make lots of noise clang 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 okay and and people were standing by and they were listening and they could hear all the the coins dropping and and everybody paid lots of attention to the people the rich people who gave lots of money and they they were really excited about that but then this one woman came in and she went to the temple treasury and she dropped two pennies into the bowl. Didn't make much noise, did it? And people didn't pay her any attention. You see, this woman, this woman was very poor. She didn't have expensive clothes and jewelry. Her husband had died, and, and she didn't have much money to spend. But you know what Jesus said to his disciples? He said, that poor woman has put in more than anyone else. The disciples couldn't understand how, how that could be. And Jesus explained, The rich people gave only some of their money, but she gave all she had. The poor woman gave her best gift to God. You see, it was, it's easy for the rich to give a lot. They had a lot, okay? But she gave everything she had. God wants us to be happy to give our money to the church. And we give because God gives to us. And we give so that other people can learn about God and Jesus. So let's say a prayer. Dear God, ask, help us to give generously and cheerfully. Amen. Now, for your activity, I want you to decorate a can or a plastic bottle or even a glass bottle if mom and dad help you, okay? And you can decorate it with construction paper or stickers or however you want to. And then start saving your coins, okay? It could be two pennies, just like the lady gave in our story, or it could be nickels and dimes and quarters. And then on March the 27th, we're going to have a bake sale, okay? And so you can bring your money and donate it to that money. And then we're going to send it all to Children's Hospital so that that children um, in South Carolina can can go and, and have things to do while they're in the hospital, okay? There, But there are other ways that you can give than just money, okay? So you can take strips of paper and write down things that can't be brought can't be bought with money like hugs and prayers and helping people do certain things okay and so write them on your slips of paper and you put those in your bottle or your bank and every week take out a strip of paper and give this priceless gift to somebody who needs it okay thanks it was good to see you and hope to see you soon bye now